here on location with Jake Jyler and John Jyler. So, guys, tell me what you saw today. Uh, 42. And what do you think about it? Um, well, he liked it more than I did. I, I liked it. Like, I love all sports movies. I kind of felt like it's a little, a little too cheesy. It felt a little too perfect, even though there were hardships, obviously, that he had to uh -huh. like, defeat. Mm -hmm. It still felt like a lot of things just happened at, like, the perfect moment, and there wasn't really... Uh, okay. Not. Well, I actually feel that every um, every baseball record <laughs> set before 1947 is invalid, because um, I, you know, Joe DiMaggio's 56-game hitting streak in 1941 would probably have been stopped cold by a fast black outfielder or a little Dominican shortstop. So this movie is very personal to me because when I was nine years old, I saw Jackie Robinson steal home against the New York Yankees in the World Series. And in fact, before they tore down the old Yankee Stadium, I made a point of taking my son to the exact spot where my father and I had sat and watched Jackie steal home. And he was safe, by the way. Yankee fans of my vintage will claim that he, that he was actually out. But um, he wasn't out. He slid under the tag. And if you take that footage and run it really slowly, you'll see that I'm right. So, um, this, you know, Ebbets Field to me was um, a really special place. So tell and, me, what was your most favorite part about the movie, 42? My favorite part was um, when he first walked out onto the green grass of Ebbets Field. It's my favorite part of every year, when you first walk out and see the green of that field. It's the greenest green there is. I, I love baseball too, and part of why I love it it's because of Jackie Robinson, so. That's great. What's your most favorite part about the movie 42? Um, probably my favorite part was when the Phillies manager was forced to make reparations for previous insults he had gave to Jackie during game in front of the entire crowd that he had, I'm not sure if it was the day before or earlier in the year, he had publicly insulted Jackie in front of and then and he just had to apologize and kind of fake how he felt, but it was still funny. So what movie are you guys going to go see next? Um, well, I definitely want to see The Great Gatsby. I know there are some people who kind of feel like they love the book and they don't want it to be ruined as... Me. Me. Like me. Like me. He, he's a writer, so... Yeah, uh, That's pretty awesome. And what are you going to go see? Uh, I don't know. I think I'm going to um, digest this and chill out for a while. You know, when, when you see a great movie, you should, you should not do anything for a week or two. You should let it sink in, I feel like. You know, that's the trouble with New York. You know, you have one peak experience after another. People in smaller places, they see something great. A week goes by, then they see something else. Here is something every day. So I think we, we all need to relax a little bit. Well, thank you guys.